So I can either talk about women or I can talk about being conscious. Being what? Being conscious. How about being a conscious woman? Right, right, right. Being conscious. Being conscious. Women. 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 So kids out of control. That's what this piece is about. It's untitled because I literally finished it last Tuesday. So. If segregation was still applicable today with this generation having it takes to stand up and fight for their civil rights. God in the Bible recognized the ultimate union of man and woman as husband and wife for life has taken a turn. Cohabitation has taken precedence in the order of succession. Why do many reality wives give a fictional portrayal of lives with no legal hold of that title? America's beauty is only skin deep. Beyond the surface lies political greed. Economic difficulties, blood of soldiers not affiliated with the military, but of those who have lost lives in the streets of their community. Fighting an international war that shows us victorious when domestically our numbers are dwindling. Bodies are progressing faster than minds. Girls are being taught in order to be accepted, they must be exploited. So they give themselves to boys who can afford them. And he too is being taught the same, using his magic stick instead of his brain to attract the opposite sex. And the sex that they have creates a new strain of STDs, but these aren't curable, so they will die due to ignorance. Mm. The latest racial tragedy was Trayvon Martin, where there was coverage about remembering him by wearing hoodies. But what about 15 year old Stefan Watts, Emmanuel Wallace Jr., who were murdered the same month for the same way racially motivated reasons, except their deaths were left out of the media? And like winter, the season of hibernation is suddenly has gotten quiet. Sometimes, some time has passed and silence is overwhelming. We need to reinvent the Million Man March in Washington, Washington. Let's march for something that defends the rights of us all and not just when something happens. These words are not a disaster, only natural translating twisting tones. Consummating pen and paper with verbal asphyxiations, tantalizing minds, bodies, and souls. Non-traditional soul food fed in large quantities to nurture knowledge and awareness. Many think we have arrived, which seems to be a joke when a black man these days can utter true words heard that he will vote his right to vote when he's actually affected. Mm. Clearly, we alone are not the reason Obama got elected. Sadly, there are others who share this rationality. Nowadays, folk children throw temper tangents and are awarded with tangible assets, but back in my day, they would have gotten their behinds kicked, and the Department of Children and Family Services didn't need to show up to handle it. Why is there more focus on banning gay marriages instead of TV shows with teen moms 16 and pregnant pushing baby carriages? Mm. We rely on the school system to we rely on the school system to thoroughly educate our children, but keep in mind that textbooks contain a skewed view of historical events. Because at the time the Constitution and Emancipation Proclamation were conceived, not all people were deemed equal. CNC value life, upholding values of people who were deemed warped. Seeds to value life, upholding people's values who are warped. They uphold gunshots as badges of honor instead of being on the honor roll, which is considered uncool. Taking another person's life instead of staying in school, and what they don't tell you is what happens next when it's all said and done. Because once that crime has been committed, it cannot be reversed. And I guarantee those who lyrically speak words with instrumental beats backing them up ain't about that life. Only motivated by the accumulation of their president, we cannot allow the media and music to raise our kids anymore. Identities are being switched with three sixes. Branding is followed like cat. We're engaged in a battle we seem to be losing, and the decisions we're choosing keep loose of the lack. Happening while we destroy ourselves, this public service announcement is about change people. Wake up and smell the aroma that's burning us. We must teach our past so they have a place in the future. Salute those who have fallen so we may rise to the occasion. We stand for nothing and we fall for anything. Complete opposite of what Martin Luther King Jr. saw in his dream. Let's regain our will to triumph in the face of adversity. Enough conversations being had, now it's time for action. Mathematically, subtract mediocrity, add intellect and self-worth. Divide carelessness and conquer vitality. Multiply beings who give a purpose. See, individually, we can make a difference, but collectively, we pack a mighty blow. Let's prepare our children for the road ahead, so once we're gone, that army will continue to be led. Woo! Hey. Hey.